All right, class, you may begin your test now. Dear Stacy, I really like you. Will you go out with me Friday night? Phil. So Phil's asking Stacy out? What a goon. <laughs> Stacy would never go out with him. But she would go out with yours truly. Dear Stacy, will you go out with me Friday night? Ron. Hey. Hey. Give it to Stacy. Oh no. Ron and Stacy? There's absolutely no way I can let my best friend Stacy go out with that slime ball. Dear Stacy, I know you're desperate for a date, so I'm gonna do you the biggest favor of your life and let you go out with me. Wrong. It's for Stacy. Ron, you dweeb meister. Stacy's not desperate. Now Joanne, <laughs> she's desperate. Ron. <laughs> Desperate? <laughs> Ron, you're the one who's been drooling over Stacy Applebaum since second grade. I'll fix you. I'm gonna set Stacy up with Phil. A note? You know you're not supposed to be passing notes in class, especially during a test. Who wrote this? <laughs> Dear Stacy, this weekend, how about it? You and me, Phil. Well, this is appalling. Dear Stacy, this weekend, is an incomplete sentence. And how about it? It is an indefinite pronoun. If we're going to write notes in class, we're going to use proper grammar. Everybody write 50 times. Dear Stacy, would you go out with me this weekend? Dear Stacy, would you go out? <laughs> 